A nigga clubhouse shenanigans on deck. Nigga, you crazy? Clubhouse shenanigans is in the room, so this is going on YouTube. So, so Wait, what? Ninja. That's what's up. Yo, Black Yo, you heard about Big Meech out? Yeah, he got out, I believe. Yesterday. Yeah, yeah. Probably the halfway. He's going to be there about six months. Yeah, no, nah, somebody close sources tell me, though, he's going to be in a, uh, he don't, they released him on house arrest until 2026. Not so, happening, boy. Not happening. They got nigga did over 20 years. He's going to do the 180 days in the halfway house. In the then be free, halfway house. Yeah, that's not happening, nigga. Too much freedom. Yeah, you think they going to, because you know his brother, his brother's still on house arrest. He got five. You no, know, his brother probably did the motherfucking halfway house i think his brother might have did some shit he he got out because uh health concerns or some shit like that no 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 we well we know that's why they say he got out yeah you know i'm gonna keep it 100 every nigga i know got out because of health concerns yeah (laughs) died in six months so yeah yeah Yeah, like most niggas they let out because of health concerns they died nigga my homie Big Rock, Big Rock Chisholm, the one Pac used to always talk about in his own. Same way, let him out. Nigga was dead two months. Yeah, I know. When they yeah, used that, look at, um, remember um, Tupac's stepdaddy, same way. They let him oh, out. Yeah. He was dead yeah, he four did. months. Mm-hmm. They let you out when they know you're about to die. They don't let you out, nigga, to live another 10, 15 years. So, you know, I don't believe this situation right either, but Half his squad told him, the majority of the niggas that told was from his side anyway. Yeah, from Southwest T's side, right? Yeah, yeah, majority of the niggas. Then I see some nigga put on some old bleary ass paperwork, but you can't even read shit. They keep sending me. Um, Sosa or somebody? Uh, Sosa, Sosa. Uh, yeah, he put something up, but it's bleary. It's supposed to be on blue, but it's bleary as a motherfucker. You can't read shit. Yeah, I ain't seen that. Hey, what's some Detroit? Some Detroit dudes trying to link with you? Oh, Mud? No, I know Mud. He came in. Somebody hit me up, told me, tell Wack that it's some Detroit dudes that's linked to Blue Da Vinci, but they really linked to Blue uh, Big U, too. Trying to link up with Wack. You know, Big U fuck with Trick Trick real tough. Yeah. Our location, all right? All right. Love you. I love you too. So, uh, yeah, uh, what you call the herd is talking, and, and uh, cause he heard that conversation, and he like, yo, what's this nigga talking about? He came up here moving the crowd on Meach Block. Whack. You remember I told you five months ago, Blue's supposed to come up here and shoot the video. Yeah. I said, you did tell me that. He said, that's all that was, bro. This wasn't about no come up here and make Meats look no top of way and none of that kind of shit. So Blue just was talking. I'm going to be real, bro. He thought the nigga was getting out next month. Dude was fucking shook. I've never seen dude that nervous, my nigga. When he was on the phone, a lot of shit he was saying was like, you know how nigga just be babbling, but they don't make sense? I'm like, bro, what the fuck are you talking about? Saying a whole bunch of shit. (laughs) And he did it so much to where he fucked up our relationship. Because he was just anything and anybody he felt that he can reach to that made him feel secure, that's what he was doing. Because when he hit me, like, the nigga FaceTime me first. And he like, whack, I need to holler at you. If you my brother, you gonna hear me out. Certain shit gotta stop. Like, some shit like that, right? So, I called the nigga out back. And he like, well, we gotta holler in person. So, I warned him. I said, hey... I don't know what you're talking about, but understand this, Blue. In person, watch what you say to me. You know what I'm saying? Because I ain't understanding what he's what he talking about. So for two days, he like, we got to holler if you my brother. Yeah. I think you went out. Did he go out, y'all, or it's me? 
I think he went out. Nah, he went out, bro. Yeah, you hear hear about this though, on Rich? What's that? Some new shit on Blue Bench? No, Big Meech, he free. Oh, Big Meech out? Yeah. But shit, he did his, he did what he was supposed to do then for himself, right? Yep, yep. Now shit, niggas just got shit. We need to be on that right there. What Wax saying? Wax saying he must take his health bad? No, no. Um, that ain't why he got out. I was talking, we was talking about his brother. His brother, Southwest T, got out because his health concerns. Oh, so they let Southwest T out too? Yeah, they been let Southwest T out. Like, yeah, he been out for a few years now. Oh, is that right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. that nigga work at the clothing store. If it's he, it, Yeah, he basically like running clothes. Hey, clothes. where is the where is the broad that's supposed to get the work for me, Big Lee Jack? Where's she at? Uh, she basically like his um thing for the show. She wanted to be the 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 show. You got a name on her, C Sar? Yeah, Tabby Calvin. Tabby yeah. Tabby Calvin Calvin, something like that. Uh huh. Yeah, you can see it just put her up. And then you see her at the premieres and everything. Right. Right. Cowan or something like that. Tammy Cowan. Yeah, what you what you think Detroit gonna be on, uh, CSA? Uh, they about to go crazy. It's about to be a party. But you know he, he you know he gotta report as soon as you know you're gonna be out, you gotta report like in twenty four hours. They gonna be watching him. Yeah, so he probably be chilled out there. He'd probably get into movies. Is it, is it in movies where he, where and shit. he want to be stayed at? I don't know if he want to stay be stayed in Atlanta or or Detroit. Yo. Yo. You know, we can hear you now. But... You hear me now? Yo, you hear me now? Yo. We can hear you now. We can hear you yeah, now. You yo. cut out. I don't know. That, did you hear what I said? The nigga called me. It was like, yo, y'all didn't win that big you enough. Y'all done did the damage. This shit need to stop. I'm like, yo, Blue, if you don't get your ass off my phone, nigga, you ain't nobody to call that type of dog, nigga. Who is you talking about? Homie, I'm just saying I put together this table to stop Big Meat's movement out here in L.A. when he get out. On some real crip shit. Well, I'm not no crip, and I don't give a fuck about how Big Meech moved. That's his business, right? But nigga, he like, well, you know Big U. I said, well, Big U at the table, nigga. Just stay away from mine. Well, homie, I don't even really know Big U. I just talked to him on the. Okay, well, you at the table with the police. That's what you doing. Then nigga, stay away from me. Now I'm cool. You know what I'm saying? And I tripped on him. That's when how him and Loose got on the phone. And Loose like, maybe you should holler at Wack. He like, because you know if you run into the nigga, how the nigga is. Like, I'm telling you, Chuck, when I run into niggas, I don't give a fuck if it's red carpet. I don't give a fuck where we at. Nigga, we going to thunder. However the thunder go, whatever kind of thunder it is. Niggas that know me know, like, dude, ignorant, bro. Like, he ain't, you know, when you think it, he going to do some way out shit. And everything with him is ignorant. Everything, like, the nigga ignorant, bro. That nigga get money, handle his business, but he ignorant. And Blue, no, I didn't call Blue in his face on Paru, dog, when we was in Liz. I bring special on here. Right? Hey, Blue, get out of my way before I beat your ass and break your jaw, nigga, on Paru, nigga. Fuck out my way. Oh, big homie, yeah, get on over there, nigga. Like, you ain't one of them kind of niggas, bro, like, at, at all. Did you catch how old he was, Chuck? Catch you. I ain't catch how old he was. Yeah, the nigga, he like 46. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, remember when he went to the fans, that's the first time he did some time. Nigga, you ain't coming up in our era, nigga, over there, beefing with all the Pyrus and Carson 
all the cop, all the power room cop, and nigga ain't got, got into nothing. Like, just be you, my nigga. Stop, stop doing all the extra shit. But me, 